Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg, and that's a 2020 Mustang GT500. Look at this beautiful car, man. She's only got like 570 miles on her. Definitely well kept throughout the uh, couple of years. She is absolutely gorgeous. I don't see a mark on the nose on it anywhere. She's just black and beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Looks like there may be one tiny little chip right there in the hood. That'll be touch upable. Just one tiny, tiny little mark on it. As you look down the side of it, she's straight as an arrow, no door dings, no scratches. Of course, you pick up on those carbon fiber wheels right away because this is a golden ticket car. The golden ticket cars came with the carbon fiber wheels, the carbon fiber wing, the, the um, it's got the oil separator on it. It's got the carbon fiber dash in there, the Recaro seats. Of course, it's got that seven speed dual clutch trans. Now I have had, oh, also this, uh, there's no back seat in a golden ticket car. I've had the pleasure of driving one of these quite a bit. As a matter of fact, I drive one about 100 miles every day, going back and forth to work, and it is a hoot, man. That dual clutch transmission shifts just on a dime, man. It's like eight milliseconds between shifts. The car knows exactly what you want to do before you know what you want to do. She handles like she's on rails. That big carbon fiber wing uh, puts a lot of downforce on the ass end of this car when you get up at top speed. Uh, and it is adjustable too. You pull this screw out, you can adjust it for some more downforce. But she's ready for the track, ready for the highway, whatever you want to do with it. Like I said, I've, uh, I've had a couple of these and driven quite a few miles. I'm sneaking up on about 20,000 miles. I've got seat time in one of these, and I have had a blast every one of those miles. And you want to talk about attention? This is an attention getter wherever you go. And the black on black car, just absolutely gorgeous. So give Tom a call at 248-974-9513, and he'll tell you all about this beautiful machine. time let's take its Cobra for a ride I'll tell you what now I got the exhaust on track mode because I love driving around making noise this thing is absolutely cool as can be now when you put it on sport mode on the driving I'll show you all that in a minute it actually takes it up to one more level of exhaust but track mode is the loudest so and you can uh, set the exhaust uh, separate from the driving style. So if you just want to drive around in normal mode and make a lot of noise, that's no problem whatsoever. We'll show you all them switches here in a minute. Now we can deliver this Mustang, or I should say GT500, anywhere in the world. You just give us a call at 248-974-9513. Tom will tell you all about this beautiful car. I'm showing 572 miles on this baby. I tell you what, I'd love to put some more on it. You can see that's just one setup on the gauges. As you go through the different modes, the uh, gauges and the way the tack and everything looks is completely different. So it's kind of cool. You can customize it however you want. I'd suggest getting on YouTube and looking at it. And there's an instruction manual about that thick. So there's all kind of switches on the steering wheel. There's all kind of switches down here. like. This is your traction control. One tap up will make your traction control go off. If you put it up and hold it for like five seconds, it'll take the advanced track off, which is the anti-yaw. So like if you're gonna do donuts or something like that, 
you want to take all that advanced track off because it will take the accelerator away from you. Also, you have your exhaust mode down there, and then you have your mode for your driving also. So that'll give you your normal driving, it'll give you your slippery weather, um, all that good stuff. This Camaro in front of us thinks he's got something. This GT500 to eat that SS for lunch. <laughs> Of course, one thing that uh, you get into as you get out on the road, of course, everybody wants to race you when they see you driving one of these. And for the most part, you've got the advantage, especially with the paddle shifters. You know what's really cool? You hold both the paddles and it makes it in neutral. Now, if you just want to downshift to the best or the gear that you need to be in for whatever speed you're going, uh, rev match it, I should say. You just hold down on the on the downshift paddle, and this thing will rev match you right to the gear that you need to be in for the best performance. Now, if you'd like to come visit us, we'd love to have you. We're close to the airport if you need to fly in. Uh, call Tom, let him know you're coming. Um, and then we're back here at our shop. We're at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. So stick with us. We're gonna put this baby up in the air right now. All right, we're underneath this Mustang now and you can really tell how well it was kept and how low the mileage are by just looking at the bottom side. Now we're gonna start right here. You can see the active exhaust in there. See that flapper in there? There's four different settings on the exhaust. So, and one of the cool things is you can go on the app and set it up. You can actually time like if you want to start it in the morning and not have a loud exhaust, you can actually set that up on the app. So I suggest you set that all up. Uh, 373 gear in here. Uh, the rear end is cooled. There's a cooler back there. It runs a fluid back there through the cooler. Of course, we got anti-lock brakes. We've got uh, traction control. I mean, it's got some giant half shafts. These lower control arms are monsters. Uh, it's got extra braces everywhere. I mean, the thing is just an absolute monster. Of course, to hold down that 760 horse, you better have a badass rear end, and they built one badass rear end here. You can see that the bottom is just as clean as a whistle here. Uh, then we have the seven speed uh, dual clutch trans here. Now this thing is a monster too. She shifts on a dime. I've been saying eight milliseconds, I guess it's 80 milliseconds. So what, what's one millisecond to another? It shifts really freaking fast. How's that grab you? Uh, one, it's a dual clutch. So one clutch does first, uh, third, fifth, and seventh. The other one does uh, reverse, second, fourth, and sixth. Um, I know a lot of people bring up these little marks right here in the frame. Now, every one of them, we've had quite a few of these Mustangs, every one of them have these little marks. I'm thinking those little robots that these cars roll around on in the factory, that must be where they set. These locating holes probably is what that thing fits into. Um, so that, that little rub marks on every one of these GT500s. We've had at least a dozen, dozen of them come through here. You can see that the nose is in great shape. Just a couple tiny faint scratches here. So you gotta be careful when you're going through a steep driveway. Definitely keep this thing away from the curb. This is definitely, it's only about that far off the ground and most curbs are about that tall. So keep this away from the curb. The car's a lot longer than it looks like when you're in the driver's seat. Then of course we got the carbon fiber wheels that all the, uh, the golden ticket cars have and then the gigantic Brembo brakes. Uh, this coating you see here is some kind of space age NASA. They used it on the space shuttle heat uh, treatment to keep the heat off of that carbon fiber. You can see the rocker molding also looking good all the way down. Uh, you can see that black paint looking sweet. I mean, this car is just sinister. Um, up front there, I forgot to tell you the size, but uh, these are the uh, Pilot Sport uh, Cup 2 wheels. Up front, we got 20 inch and they are 305 um, 30 20s up front. Out back, we got 315 30 20s out back. And again, carbon fiber wheel, great big Brembo brakes. Then that other caliper C up there, that's actually the parking brake. Guys, we're gonna lower this baby down and see what's making all the horsepower. All right, under the hood here, we got the 5.2 liter, 760 horse, supercharged GT550 power plant. They call it the Predator. Now you can see that, uh, looks like Shane built this one. Everybody, they hand build these things and then they sign them. Uh, of course, power brakes, power steering, and then anti-lock brakes, air conditioning, the whole nine yards. 
We got our air filter in here. The battery is actually underneath that uh, panel right there, uh, right in front of the passenger seat. I mean, she is a monster, guys. You can see uh, this crossbar here between the shock towers. Uh, that is magnesium. Then we got carbon fiber up here for the core support. I mean, everything about the car is just amazing. Now, this cover right here comes off. So when you take this baby to the racetrack, you can take this cover off, let a lot more heat out of this thing. So ready to go, guys. Give us a call, 248-974. 9513. I about forgot the number there for a second. Call Tom anytime. He's answering his phone 24 7.